Hey, what's up guys? So, some of you that's been following me for over a year may remember that ski bike project, which was a really fun to build and to test either. But you know, there's always something you can improve to make things better, so I decided to modify my old ski bike with a new pair of back skis and some other stability improvements. So I'm gonna basically cut a rear side of a bike frame, which is gonna be replaced with a custom made turning mechanism. The plan is really simple, whenever I'm gonna tilt a bike up to a certain angle, the rear mechanism will adjust its lean angle and provide a great grip on the snow. That should work in theory, but we'll prove that in the upcoming weeks. I didn't use any special bearings on these moving parts, because I wanted to make it as cheap as I could, so I'm gonna use some teflon washers and two nuts on the back, so I can tighten all joints up to a point where the friction is low enough, I can move everything smoothly, but still achieve a decent stability with as less wobbliness as I could. Skis are gonna be attached to this metal coupler with a thick rubber in between the joint, which is gonna act as a small shock absorber and still allow skis to change in angle when going through some small bumps of snow. Front ski mount is gonna be free driven on the shaft and that's it. The plan is also to add a bike seat, but that's not necessary since most of the time I'm gonna stand on the bike pedals, but anyways, maybe it's gonna come in handy. As you can see, whenever I tilt a ski bike, rear skis try to adapt to a lean angle and I don't know if you can notice, but on each turn, one of skis goes a bit forward, like you would do when you go carving at high speeds. That's all for today guys, thank you for watching, next week I'm gonna build a frame and weld everything up with a new TIG welder, so stay tuned and I'll talk to you soon.